Warning, I swear a lot. Hi guys, and welcome back to Total War Shogun 2. Welcome back to the Sengoku Jidai. Welcome back to the age of the country at war. Not that you can tell, because we have been consigned to this fucking island for the entirety of the campaign. I am sick of the Atomo. I am sick of this fucking island. We're going to get off of here. I'm going to make it happen. We have some things we need to deal with first, though. Chiefly this, really. Now... I'm not a good commander, but if I was, I would still not be confident in trying to sally forth and attack that army. Maybe, once Winter has taken its toll and he's suffered some losses, we could perhaps have a go at him then? Or he might just attack Bungo, who knows. But something's gonna happen. It's not looking great, but we have to make some kind of move. We need to take Satsuma back. That is a huge nightmare, not having that. Oda, why? They have eight provinces! At least the Takeda didn't join them. Talking is done. Great. They land an army. I'm fucked. Much like the Mori. The, M the Mori have landed an army. Why did I say any- Oh, no. Okay, well, this campaign might be over soon. Oh. They're gonna fight to the end. You better believe we are. Okay, they are actually attacking us. Do a cheeky little quick save. Now, I am relatively certain that attempting to actually run this battle is going to destroy the capture. They have so many bow samurai. We have, like, three archers. We have a lot of Katona Samurai, so we will be able to cut through their, uh, their Yaris, but still, this ain't what I want. So part of the issue with this situation, of course, is the fact that, honestly, my plan would have been, once we defeated this army, is to perhaps take that momentum forward to attack the Otomo, maybe take back a province, maybe head north or something, but now that the Mori have landed an army, the Damio's force is going to have to stay here. Which means any and all conquest is entirely down to Tanagashima and his force, who aren't going to be getting reinforced because we don't have any money. Oh, hey Daisy, you scared the crap out of me, Jesus Christ. Whatever, let's just see how this goes, I suppose. And we're back. Okay, so I'm not really worried about this battle, to be honest. I'm pretty sure we'll win this. We're pretty evenly matched. Um, I have strong units. I have Katana Samurai, who will carve through them like motherfuckers. But of course, that's not really the issue, is it? The issue is that we need to win this battle with very few casualties. Which is not likely. So that we can actually fight the Mori as they approach. Um... I don't see that happening. I see that as being a big unlikely, to be honest. But uh, what am I supposed to do? Just not play the video game? I can't not play the video game. I'm doing a show. I am required, obligated, you might say, to play the video game. Regardless of what the outcome might actually be. I personally get the impression that we are looking at the beginning of the end. I think, like, you know, we've been very brave up until this point. I think things are about to come to an end. Maybe not this episode. Maybe. But I think the decline is happening. And I don't like that. I don't like that at all. It's so coming from this side. We have archers, some bow samurai. Yari Ashigaru. This side, just bow samurai. And from this side is the general, a bunch of his Yari Ashigaru and some bow samurai just to piss me off further. We don't have way of the bow, that's annoying. Coming in, they're coming in. We're giving them some good arrow fire, and that should whittle down their numbers a bit. We put you down there. Um, unfortunately, you can't just stay in there. You're going to have to move out of the way. You're about to be in danger. This formation. Let's slow down time a little bit, do a little time stop, do 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 do, and... Set you guys up there. What is that? Three units of Yari Ashigaru over there. One unit coming up here. We'll have those guys take care of that. Oh, they're going right where I wanted to put my archers. Annoying. Don't do that, please. Um, oh, my brain is stopping while I'm doing this. Okay, so that. They're coming up here as well. Honestly, I'm thinking of using my generals in a bit more of a proactive role this time and actually have them take out their cav the cavalry. Take out their archers because they have so much bow samurai that it's going to become a serious issue. <laughs> 
Oh wow, they already made it on the wall. Okay, well, um... Get the samurai retainers involved. They're expendable. You're on your way somewhere. Serve Yari wall formation. It's better for you. You're already in combat. You're already in combat. You're getting ready to meet these poor saps who are coming up the wall. Just realize that's not even a good place for you. So we'll move you over there. It's all good. Sure enough, they're already wavering. Like, you know, the fucking... The Yari Ashigaru, they're not particularly brave. And it's fairly early in the campaign, so they're not, like, upgraded or anything. The general has just made his way outside. Excellent, excellent. We're going to start by hitting those guys. Wait till they get off of there, because they are notoriously slow when moving across narrow slopes and shit like that. Seriously, I've been fucked by that so many times, and it is the most infuriating thing. Keep a mental brain map on that. They're now attacking them, which is just fine. They're in Yari Wolf formation. Everything is good. You're about to break, because you are really just pansies. You should pull back. Um, don't really want you in melee. Those Katana Samurai have it under wraps. Get you over there, that's where the bulk of their forces are, and we could really do with not losing a bunch of people. They're now trying to come after us, but I think by the time we get them over there and hit those bow samurai, they will we rout their tower, my lord. before they can stop us. That is the plan anyway, I hope it works that way. You know, it could be anything really. Could even not be the thing I said. That's my life. Once they break, we can get these guys back on the um, cover of the walls. Get the archers back over there, they can start hitting the... Just everything around here, really. Start shooting at the archers from cover, which is very helpful. Now, you guys, ruin their day. I don't want to see any Otomo Samurai. Ever. I want them all dead. Are you guys broken yet? They sure are, wow. Katana Samurai work quick, don't they? Fucking hell. Alright. Get over there. Get over there, get in there where it is safe. Start laying down some fire. Any opportunities we have to reduce losses, we are going to take. They're coming after us because they're stupid. Because the general's just going to run away from them again. Like so. We've now shattered one of their units of bow samurai, so uh, great for them, I suppose. Wait. Wait. It's not good for them. I lied. I am a liar. This is what I do. I lie. Okay. Well, you may as well... Actually... We'll keep you on- we'll keep you on standby, my man. We might need your help. Just in case the general just gets a little impatient. And he decides to rush us. They're steady. Don't want to be charging the general into them. I'll probably just try and get the general back into the fucking- Um, they have a lot of archers. They still have a lot of archers, and I actually don't like it. So, these haven't all broken yet Our either. General is in grave danger, my lord. Okay, is he being shot at or is he being stabbed? Uh, stabbed. No, no, guys. Guys, seriously. We're not, we're not playing this game, alright? Get back in the fucking fort. If you want to die so badly, there will be more opportunities in the future. They, they literally lost one guy. You know what? I can live with that. <laughs> I can live with those kinds of losses, because that's nothing. Why are you two going outside? Get back in the castle. You as well. I swear to God, I wish their AI would fucking get a grip. You tell them to attack something on the walls, but most of their force is still outside. So they go outside to attack them, and that is suicide. If they actually get in here, then we're going to destroy them. Like, that is a bad move for the generals. Alright, I want you to move over there, because there are plenty of archers to deal with. We should move our melee units back, because they aren't benefiting from cover right now. Keep you there. You're pretty far back, why don't we shuffle you up a little bit. The generals are now back in, nice and safe, we'll dismount- yeah, we'll dismount them so they can help. What are you doing?! What are you- oh, they're the retainers, fuck them. <laughs> fuck them. Uh, if they're gonna be stupid, they are completely disposable. Fuck them. They li they'll literally regenerate next turn anyway, who fucking cares? If they want to be stupid, it's their funeral, isn't it? From the battlefield. I don't care. Shame for this play. In the meantime, the general units are getting the shit shot out of them, so, you know, every bad has a good, when you think about it. These guys are idiots. I don't even know what the fuck they were thinking. It's to the point, actually, where I might remount my fucking kid general unit, because the only- the next melee unit to go up is the fucking generals. At which point, the bow samurai will be completely vulnerable. 
We are suffering some casualties. How are you doing? You're okay. You're okay. You will be okay, more to the point. You ain't got any One fire arrows left. Used all its ammunition, my lord. They're shooting the Ari Ashigaru garrison, which is great because we can spare that. You know, my yeah, my Ashigaru, my bow Ashigaru are actually racking up some kills. It's quite impressive, actually. Very pleased with them. Okay, they're climbing the walls. Let's just slow down time. Do, 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 do. Make Jojo noises, etc, etc. I don't even watch Jojo, I just know it through pop culture. Let's get you over here. Are they climbing the walls now? They sure are. Okay, you guys, you guys, back off. Get you over there. We have a bunch of Katana Samurai to just really cause them some issues, you know? And the general unit, uh, well, are they committing all of their archers to this attack? Not really. And there's a fucking plane going overhead, so you might hear some background noise, but I am too in the moment of combat to fucking worry about that shit. So, yeah, there it goes again. Y'all just gonna have to deal with it. And if you can't hear it, then great. I expelled a bunch of spiel for nothing. You can definitely hear that. I'd be shocked if you can't hear that. That's really bad. <laughs> what the fuck? Go away! That'll do. Okay, well we're nearly done here. I just hope we've been able to do this without uh, too many casualties. Because that's really the main thing. We were always going to win this, but were we going to win this comfortably? Were we going to win this and still have enough troops to hold off the Mori? That's the actual question. You guys ain't doing nothing. And as I say, the Ariashigaru garrison can't actually take Bo Samurai, because Bo Samurai are actually reasonably tough in a fight. I want you to hit those guys before they even get up the wall. Smash them. Oh shit, the general. Ah, oh, the general. Ah, oh, the generals were still down here. Give you a boost. How are those the Ariashigari garrison losing so badly? Winning slightly. Combat even. They're doing okay. There we go, they've changed their mind. Oh yeah, their entire force is routing. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Oh yes, I do believe that is the thing that has just fucking happened, doesn't it? You absolute fucking losers. Oh, look at them run. Sadly, I don't think we'll be able to kill the general. We should have really tried to get him to actually scale the wall first, but to be honest, I thought he was already scaling the wall, which is why I led these guys around. Fortunately, Takahisa Shimazu and Hidenari Kawamura are absolute stacked up units, and we had nothing to worry about. I told you to kill those guys. I told you to kill them. Get to killing them, man. We, uh... We want every last fucking Otomo we can kill dead. Go on, get him. Go on, get him. Yeah, last three. Over there. I want every single one dead. You misunderstand me. I don't want some of them dead. I want all of them dead. Haha. -ha. Sorry, I had a message. <laughs> the missus could wait five seconds for me to respond, but I like to stay on top of these things. We lost the garrison units, which is just fucking fine, because they are useless anyway. Yeah, we trashed the Mori. We trashed Mori. Mori. God, the Mori. We trashed the Atomo. That's great. Now back the fuck off. They won't back the fuck off, they're just gonna stay in our land and be a pain. And it would actually be worth riding out to take care of that army because it's already weakened and it's gonna be attritioned, but of course, the Mori are on the way. You remember that? The Mori? I would send these guys back to bolster the defenses, but to be honest, they wouldn't get there in time anyway. That Mori army is so large, I don't think we're gonna be able to stop them because we didn't even get to recruit new units in that time. You're not gonna level up. I'm thinking of anything I can get which might- I tell you what, actually, I don't know, Mori, Mori, Mori. We're trying to keep the fucking playthrough alive. Speak, but with care. Why well, have Koro you 38 Roku, face. and what if I gave you my my son? Uh... Uh... Oh, come on, man, that's literally all I have. What if I gave you that? Uh, but, uh, fucking god! They're gonna fucking trash Bongo. Bongo won't survive this. Look at the size of that army, and I can already see a bunch of samurai. We're not even dealing with Yari Ashigaru this time. It'll be full-fledged samurai. 
and at least three generals, although that really doesn't matter that much, actually. In fact, that's probably a good thing, because they're wasting unit space with those. You guys, scout out the Christians, please. I want to know what's going on. We don't have enough forces. They're going to need to be joined by that army before they can even think about doing that. But And we're making 14 per turn. We're not going to make much more than that until we take back Satsuma. But we can't take back Satsuma yet. This trade route is actually for nothing. It's not doing anything because it's not going anywhere. Because apparently this harbor won't receive trade for whatever fucking reason. That just, they're just not doing it. I'm curious, how much Christianity is currently? Uh, one third of our land, approximately, is Christian. Honestly, I might accept a Nanban trade fucking thing and just have guns. Guns would be nice, maybe guns would save me. The ninja can't do anything because he doesn't- we don't have any money. He literally can't do anything. What benefit do you provide by actually joining- I think it's just like you range or something stupid. How much money- uh, Your army's practically dead. We need to get rid of them. We do, we do, we do. Well, I ain't gonna fucking chase them. The samurai retainers and the Ariashigaru garrison will come back, but... I don't think that's going to be enough. I really, really, really don't. It's doing Way of the Sea, and that's great, but that doesn't actually help me at this current moment in time. In essence, the spirit is useless. We need more money, but 15 turns for Chinondu? Chinindo? That was exactly the opposite of how it's pronounced. I think Way of the Birth and Heaven and Earth. Way of the Birth and Heaven and Earth? Way of the Bow and Heaven and Earth? I am losing it. But point is, I think these two will be great, because they'll just make our archers so much better. The ability to use fire arrows and to have more ammo is, is good. I don't think we'll even live long enough to get way of the bow, let alone heaven and earth. But hey, let's just see what happens, shall we? We're so fucked. Because if they, take, if they get through Bongo, they're going to rip through Hugo like no one's business, because that place is completely unmanned and I can't afford to replenish it. And Osumi, well, Tanagashima's pretty tough. This garrison's not enough. It's not close to being enough. They have to hold Bongo. If they don't hold Bongo, we're doomed. But they have to hold it against Mori Motonari himself. Or Motonari Mori, whatever. I can't do it, guys. This fucking campaign's about to end. And the Oda are here. Just hanging out. Here they come. You know what? That's... The numbers aren't as bad as I thought, but it's worth pointing out, they do still have an absolute fuck-ton of Yari Samurai. Now, I'm pretty sure Katana Samurai are going to be pretty good against them. Not good enough, though. Not good enough. Got an itch in my leg. Oh, that's bad. Alright, well, let's throw down the quick save and look at this objectively. Also, the capture will break, so I'm going to say everything I need to say now. We have two generals. I think, honestly, Kawamura should go out into the field and act as a decoy. We can't afford to lose the Daimyo for a variety of reasons, but most importantly, our army will fall apart if he dies. We need to send Kawamura out there to just get their attention, just cause some trouble, have some of their Yari Samurai running around and not attacking the walls at the same time. Our melee units are just going to have to do everything they can to hold them off. Right. I'm confident the Katana Samurai will do well, but the Yari Ashigaru not so much. Although, if they're in Yari Wolf Formation, if I can set it up, we should be alright. And the Samurai Retainers can join in where they need to. The Archers are going to have to do their fucking best, but they're going to be moving around a lot because they will hit the walls and they have so many Yari Samurai that there's going to be nowhere safe on the walls for them to stand. So, they're just going to have to move around, and they're going to get shot the fuck out of if they aren't already shooting our main melee forces. But I've talked long enough, let's see how this goes. Excellent, and we're back. Okay. This fucking, this fight, I don't even... I don't even know. I, I don't know. This could go in either direction, really. If things work out very well, it could work. But if they don't, then it won't. Like, I don't know how else to describe it. No amount of commentary pizzazz is going to make this situation any different from what it actually is. And what it is, is 
troublesome and crucial. Because if we lose here, the entire campaign is dead. The entire campaign will end. I promise you that. Not, I won't end the video. I won't end the series until the campaign ends. Until I am destroyed. Like, I will fight to the last. But if we lose here, I'm pretty sure we've lost. Let's give this a go. Okay, let's slow down time. Do, 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 do. So, a bunch of samurai coming from that direction. Samurai from that direction. Oh, look, samurai from that direction. And then the rest of the... Well, actually, that's pretty much all their archers. And, like, two units of Yara samurai. Okay. We're going to need to plot fucking Kawamura's route very carefully because he's in a lot of danger. I would, if possible, oh wow, he's got stand and fight. I completely forgot about stand and fight. All right, let's have you stand over there. We'll get you set up, and then you'll be able to give our boys some juice. I would really, if we're going to win, I'd like to win with Kawamura still alive. And to be completely honest, I don't think he needs to die. I don't think it's going to be a case of like we have to sacrifice Kawamura. It's the only way we'll win. But, uh, I also see his odds of survival being quite low. In fact, if he manages to draw those two units... These archers could actually just go over here instead. We could just have everyone... ...firing on them. I don't know, we'll have our melee units prepare to, you know, actually get into position and hold them off because they he won't be carting them around forever. Eventually, they're going to grow a fucking brain and not follow him anymore. But till then, he could do something useful. In the meantime, we'll have fucking T Takahisa over here just chanting to himself and that should, should, make everyone a little tougher. Increases their melee attack skill, so it'll be their ability to actually land hits in combat. So... You know, a blow from a spear from home, from the hand of a Yari Ashigaru is just as deadly as a blow from a katana. Alright, we appear to have fucked with them a little bit. Yes, that's three samurai going in the wrong direction. He will be in charge of leading those three- Oh, hello. Are you- Nah, you guys are on target. Okay. Kawamura is going to be in charge of kiting these fuckers around. Three less units of Yari samurai attacking us is- Crucial. Absolutely crucial. Now, where is your range? Where is your range? Oh, it's totally with... Okay, great. So we'll benefit from it no matter what. Okay, you guys. I want you to get ready to receive our guests. We are just about to receive guests over here. The problem is Yari Samurai have better armor than um, Ashigaru. So, of course, they're more resistant to archer fire, but like, what options do I have? Just don't shoot at them? That's stupid. You're stupid. They're still chasing them. Good. I just need to keep an eye on him and occasionally move him around. And that'll be them off my back. Okay, they're about to breach the walls. They're attacking us from two different points on this, like, front, as it were. So, we're already running out of units to put in places, actually. Now I think about it. Oh, no. Put you there. Ah, the numbers game is really not looking good, actually. Oh, it's looking very bad. Even with Kawamura drawing away three of them, it's... Hmm, I'm really going to need to keep an eye on that situation as well, because if he dies, then they'll start coming from the wall. Uh, okay, we've got Katana Samurai. We're going to need to distribute our forces very carefully and precisely, and we need to make sure that at some point, somewhere in this... In this lineup, as it were, each front, we need to be superior to them. So that the dominoes can start to fall and our units can start to reinforce each other. Because if we're just holding them off in each location, barely, I don't think we're going to be able to do it. it. We don't have the numbers for the long game. I don't know. I don't really know what to... I don't know what to do. I don't know what to suggest. Start taking out their archers. The last thing we need is arrows falling on our heads, to be honest. It's, you know, you guys really need to stop moving forward. Okay, the Ari Samurai are coming. Let's not waste any time. 
we're gonna have the fucking katana samurai get straight in there. We need to start killing them immediately. I want to put them in loose formation, but I'm worried they'll spill into the melee with the samurai. We're just gonna have to let it go for now. They're coming. Okay. Samurai retainers charge immediately. We need to kill as many as we can as quickly as we can. Anything we can do to turn the odds in our favor. Oh god, I forgot about this. I told our my men are running from the Oh god. Shame for this play. I told myself not to forget about that. Great. Well, there's three more Yari samurai on their way. And I oh know Hitamura Kawamura might be dead, but that's honestly the least of my concerns right now. They're just running free. That's not what I want you to do. Not you. You. No, go hit the fucking samurai. We'll let the archers hold them off for a moment, and then once the katana samurai get involved, they can fall back. That'll be fine. How are you doing? You're in even. You're even. You are. We are killing them. They are dying. This is an issue. They are outnumbered by a katana samurai, and they're on their way. To the point where you're gonna actually have to... Oh god, is he gonna have to fight a unit of Yari Samurai on his own? No, he isn't. No. This is equally as foolhardy, but... Oh, wow, actually, they're rave... Whoa, 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 hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Pile in. Okay, pile in. You're gonna stop doing that because we can't afford for you to do it. Give those samurai a boost, they need it. Okay, I may have fucked up that plan I had, but it might still be okay. The general is gonna have to fight these guys for now because we need, we can't have them just running around willy-nilly, you know? We need to be keeping them in check. But in some places they're already crumbling. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Well, he's in a better position than Kawamura, isn't he? <laughs> At least they're going to be exhausted by the time they get back. If we can start taking out some of these units. Winning. Even. That's great. Keep it up, boys. Keep it up. Now, if you can start killing these guys before more of them get on the wall, the numbers will become a lot more even. And that'll be good. They're breaking. Oh, they've broken even. Oh, duh. Fucking super. Uh, yeah. Just clear that entire section of the wall. They're falling back. Wow, I severely overestimated their katana samurai. I tell you what, Jesus Christ. All right, um, archers, archers, archers. Do not get overly confident, okay? Actually, thinking about it. Y'all can go back on the walls now and start returning fire. Um, you. Rescuing the general should be our priority, arguably. We still have to contend with the fact that three more units of Yari Samurai are on the way, but you know what? I'm not as scared of them as I was before, to be honest. Wow. 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 The Mo Mori Samurai suck. <laughs> like, to a serious degree. This is going better than I could have dreamed. Despite Kawamura. I don't think Kawamura was killed. I hope not. But despite his sacrifice, which was entirely unnecessary, <laughs> it seems to be going well. And you know what? Takahisa honestly managed to contend with them on his own. I think Katana versus Yari is just, you know, it's always going to be in Katana's favor. But then, of course, Katana's aren't great against cavalry. Perhaps that's the rock, paper, scissors, like, mentality that I didn't quite catch on to. They're all Bow Ashigaru. I'm not worried about them getting up close. Move back. There we go. You don't need to be in combat anymore. Let's set you to do stand and fight again, because the last thing we need is the Damio to get killed. Really, we don't need it. Combat even. Combat even. You're fighting off Yari Samurai. Even the most common peasant man can stand up to a samurai if he just puts in the fucking work. And my boys, my boys, putting in the work. All day, every day. I shouldn't have used that yet. I should have waited for them to come back. But to be honest, the archery towers don't matter that much. I'm going to move you back here. If I could avoid having you be completely destroyed, that'd be great. Their archers are not happy. Because now we're able to shoot at them without taking too many hits. I don't know if they're after them. But I'm going to move them back just in case. Alright, you now you set up standard fight. Probably should have used Rally first, but then again, we're not low on morale, so who cares? Wow, we have decimated their samurai. It's kind of absurd, actually. 
I think having the retainers and the katana samurai go at their generals is probably going to be enough to get rid of them. I think that's going to be just fine. And then our Yari Ashigaru could hold off those. By the time they get here, we're going to be done with their generals anyway. This is absurd. God damn, the Mori suck. Which is weird, because I'm playing a campaign with them on another save file, and they're actually kind of my favorite clan to play as. I don't know why. I don't know why. These guys are kind of lame, but I like playing as them. Also, I know the graphics are terrible. I had to turn it down for the, for the, for the recording. I need to get another computer. So I can, you know, have one computer do the recording and the other computer do this. You know, I was just talking about all those plans, it just occurred to me, I haven't actually moved my units over there to go deal with the generals, I just talked about it, and then was like, yeah, that'd be a cool plan, and, hmm, maybe I should actually do it, oh, I don't know, do it, kill him, do it now, kill him. You guys can't be feeling good seeing your buddies running off with there's only six of them left. Maybe y'all fucked up. Maybe you should have stayed with the main battle line instead of following that one general who was rank one and actually didn't matter that much, you know? Just a little bit of a military advice. I am a strategist. I don't know if you've noticed. There's still a formidable amount of generals, right? There's no need to take these guys lightly. If the combat doesn't look like it's going the way I want it to, we'll start piling in the Ashigaru as well. Okay. Well, we don't want the general. We want these guys. Go in, start taking heads. You guys, I want you to keep firing. I know some of you can see them. It's not an ideal angle, but it keeps them in cover, so it's all good. Oh yes, they're coming from that direction too. I wonder, is that... I don't think that's their Damio, but that's fine. Oh guys, fuck them up, go on, go on, go on. How are these guys doing? They're getting closer, but they haven't got here yet. Now fuck them up. Divide and conquer, you know the drill. You two, head over there. And you can start taking care of the last one. You don't even need to be better than them, you just need to hold them off until these guys are done. Or those guys are done, then they'll kill those, and then they'll kill those. And oh, it will be a treat for the eyes, you won't believe it. I can't believe we're actually holding them off. I guess I was being way too dramatic, but I really thought that an army comprised entirely of Yari Samurai would be a problem. I guess I was wrong. <laughs> Fucking obviously, but... You know what? I've never been so happy to be wrong in my entire life. It feels good to be wrong sometimes, because it means that you were wrong, but you thought the bad thing and were incorrect about it, therefore... It's a good thing. You see what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Smell what I'm stepping in? get the spit, spit that's flapping from my lips. And we can just murder, like, most of the Mori family in one fell swoop. That's great, too. And now the archers are trying to climb the wall as well. Oh, you, I see you want to have a big pile in. Yeah, the retainers aren't doing great because there's not many of them and they are fighting a general. My I don't Lord, blame them for that. Their general has fallen! He sure has. Cutting blow. Okay, well, all the archers are now going to start climbing the walls. I want to see if you can shoot some of their samurai before they get up here. Why the hell not? These guys can handle fucking bow Ashigaru, for fuck's sake. Get a grip. You are embarrassing yourselves, although I guess the plan here, really, would be to try and keep my katana samurai occupied whilst their Yaris climb the wall, but we've already established that Yaris in Yari wall formation can hold off these samurai. Like, they don't have anything. Also, their generals are about to die, so... Their morale's gonna fucking plummet. It doesn't matter. I don't know why I'm doing slow motion anymore. It's not necessary. Just murder their Boashgaru, mate. Just, just get them out of my sight. They're fucking useless. Oh, look at that. They've all shattered. Their general has fallen. Hell yeah. Cutting blow. Murder them. I want them all dead. Not some of them. Ah, uh, if only we had horsemen. Oh, that's, you should have kept Kalamura alive, because now he could have mopped them up. Continue. Uh, I don't know. Can anyone... You can. Bruv, get on your horse. Get on your horse. We have the opportunity to wipe out an absolute fuck ton of Yari Samurai. We would be foolish not to try and take it. Come on, man. Get to your horse. Faster if you would. <laughs> you fucking asshole. Do you not realize... 
how important this is. Look at all those Yari Samurai we could be killing. There's so many. And you're just gonna let them get away. Are you on your horse? Yes. Turns out you can actually do that quite quick. Okay. Get them. 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 This went better than I could have dreamed. Seriously, I didn't think we were gonna win. Like, Yari Samurai are good units. They are. I think leading those three samurai away with Kawamura really made the difference. I think if we hadn't done that and they'd actually attacked with their full force, we would have been in serious trouble. Although then again, Kawamura would have been on hand to fight them in that. Nah, because it's an extra three samurai. Nah, no way. Kawamura, what he did was very important. Go on, my man. Just give him the business, I suppose. As much business as you can. You didn't kill many of them, but you killed some of them. And they're going to feel really stupid. Many as you can, many as you can, many as you can. Any samurai they don't walk away with is a victory for us. I think we can end here. Close victory. I honestly wouldn't say that was close. We kind of had that in hand. We didn't realize how much we had that in hand. I had no idea how much we had that. Those of you who know this game would be able to tell, but I want to point out, just in case some of you aren't clear, this is on hard. This is on hard difficulty. The fucking Katana Samurai, oh my god. And Kawamura survived. He alone survived. He he did a great job, I tell you what. It's thanks to him that we still hold Bongo. But this creates opportunity for us. Now that we've held we've held Bongo, we've survived. We can actually counterattack. We have that opportunity now. Is it gonna come anytime soon? No, probably not. But We've survived. The Mori have been humbled, right, to a serious degree. We'll have you poke around up north. I want to see what they're working with in Bonzen or Buzen. It's very weak. So if we could hit Higo with Tanagashima's army. Link up, link up. I honestly doubt that's going to be a big enough army, but we might just have to deal with it. We might have to, like, siege them and try and wait them out, and then maybe they'll sally forth and we'll have to fight them that way. I don't know. All I know, for sure, is that Tanagashima's army has to take Satsuma. Has to. There's no other option. We, th we can't build more units. What he's got here is going to have to do. The same with the Damio, to be honest. This army will have to do. I'm going to chase down those units, but I'm going to keep Kawamura out of it, because I'm scared he's going to get himself killed. So let's just wipe him out. We're not going to be able to chase down the Atomo army, but that's fine. I think they learned their fucking lesson. Or not. Or they'll come back and be a huge problem. Anything could happen. I can't believe. The fucking Damio, right? The fucking Damio. Takahisa Shimazu. He's doing it. He's doing things. His Katana Samurai are... The most stacked up units in the land. Excellent blend of attack and defense, murdering everything in their faces. It's good. The Oda are a huge problem, but like, what can I actually do about that right now? All I can do is just sit here and hope that they don't do anything. It was kind of like that with the Mori, and I suffered for that because the Mori then attacked me. But, you know. Once again, I didn't have any options. So first, I want to scout this out and see if they could just take Satsuma outright. Because if they can, we need to take that that situation. They probably could. We're going to suffer some losses, though. But we need that money. That money is so important. We lost the archers. That's fine. We can work with that. We've taken back Satsuma. There we go. Okay. Wow. I mean, there's a lot of repairs to do and we have no money. Well, that money will come back. Can we trade with anyone? I could really do us some trade. Oh, no, I can't trade. Oh, we lost most of our trade ships. Oh, great. Cool. That was most of our money. Uh, 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 that's, uh, that's fine. You guys join that. Wait a minute. Waco trade ships don't do anything for money. 
Wait, what? Hang on. Yeah, they do nothing. Oh, for f mm. they're just ships to throw away in combat, I guess. You get out of here. It does say in the description that it's like they're not actually traders, they're pirates. But I figured they still counted. Oh god, that's a huge... It's not actually a huge, but it's still too big. And most of my fleet currently consists of trade ships and trade ships. Ah. Uh, okay, well, whatever. I'm gonna end it here. We took back Satsuma. We fended off the Otomo uh, and the Mori. Truly, Bungo will never fall. Not while Takahisa Shimazu holds the walls. It's just not gonna happen. He's too fucking strong. Can you get back? Yeah. Come back. I really want him to rank up because a level one ninja is one of the most useless things in the game for doing anything other than being a scout. And scouts don't gain experience. But yeah. We held off the Otomo. We held off the Mori. We took back Satsuma. That monk who did all that shit and caused us to lose Satsuma multiple times, is dead. He will never do it again. Next turn, I'm gonna have the ninja investigate Higo and see if we can do something about that. However, Tanagashima's army is a little bruised and battered and they have no archers. So we might have to wait a little while. On the other hand, if Higo is completely undefended, I might just send him in balls to the wall, guns blazing, fuck it. Actually, let's have a look at diplomacy real quick. Otomo, power, strong. They still have a big army, apparently. Who are they at war with? They're also at war with the Shosakabe. Just quickly, Shosakabe, you've got four provinces. You're doing all right. You've secured that little island that you live on. Their enemies are Urakami, Otomo, Mori. Just, just, why can't we trade? And what would you ask? They don't want the alliance anyway. Fuck, it doesn't actually matter, really, does it? They're fighting the people I want them to fight. Who cares? But I'm, you know. I'm doing stuff, I'm talking more about stuff, I'm rambling, we got in the episode, thank you so much for watching. Jesus Christ, the Date. Look at the Date. Wow, I've never seen them do well. They always do shit, in fact the Oda often die pretty quick as well, so this is an interesting board. The Hitaki armor are doing really well, Mori are standard, Urakami are still alive, Chosukabe are doing alright, and the Otomo are a real pain in my ass. I'm rambling once again, thank you so much for watching, whatever happens next time, and I don't know, are we moving towards taking the island? I don't actually fucking know. But whatever happens, I hope I see you there. Toodles. Goodbye. Safe again, just to make sure.